If you want to learn how to use tags in System.io promoting affiliate products, in this video, I'll be sharing with you just that. Let's dive in. Now, the first step in this whole entire process is to head on over to System.io and you want to sign up. It's as easy as entering your email address and clicking on this button here that says get my free account. Now, let's go over some amazing features System.io offers. You can create sales funnels, send marketing emails, build websites, manage your affiliates, create online courses, automate your marketing, and so much more. Now, once you're all signed up, you're going to be brought up to your dashboard, which pretty much looks like this. Now, you may not see no new leads, but no worries because, you know, as you start creating your sales funnels and your marketing and things like that, you're going to start generating leads. Let's assume we created a sales funnel for a specific affiliate product. So if I click on funnels here, I do have a funnel right there. It says free lead magnet ebook funnel. By the way, if you want access to it, I will leave a link in the description so that way you can get complete access to this funnel. Now, if I go to contacts, I click on contacts. I do have an email address there, but guess what? I don't even know where it came from. That's why it's important to tag your sales funnels. And that's the whole point of this video today. And I'm going to show you exactly how to do it step by step. Now, let's actually go and find an affiliate product that we can see here and use as an example. So I'm going to go over here to ClickBank. And by the way, ClickBank is a marketplace. You can find a bunch of different affiliate products. So all you got to do is just sign up so that way you can get access to this dashboard. But I'm going to click on health and fitness. And right here, I'm going to use this affiliate product. I'm going to copy that name. I'm going to come back over here to system.io. Right under contacts, I'm going to click on tags. Now I'm going to click on create. And now I'm going to paste in that name just like that. I'm going to click on save. So right there, I do have a tag created. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to funnels. Okay. Let's assume this funnel is that actual, you know, affiliate product from ClickBank. So I'm going to click on this funnel here. I'm going to click on automation rules. Okay, now what we want to do is make sure we're on the squeeze page, this first step. Now we want to add a rule. Click on that. Funnel step form subscribe. Make sure you click on this one. So now what we want to do is actually click right inside of this, um, this blue outline. And we want to click on add action, all right? Click on add action. And right here, we're going to want to click on add a tag. Right here in this uh, drop down, just click on that tag you created. Boom. Now I'm going to click on save rule. And just like that. So if I go back over here to step configuration, I click on this link right here. I open up a new tab. I paste it in just like that. So once somebody clicks on your sales funnel, you know, they're going to be brought up to a page that looks similar to this. Um, they're going to click on this button. Guess what? It's going to bring up a pop-up where they can enter in their best email. So all you pretty much got to do is just enter in the email. Now I'm going to click on the call to action, get booked. And there you have it. Okay. Now it's going to take that lead, you know, on a journey throughout your sales funnel. So for instance, if they click on this button, it's going to take them over to a next step. All right. But what I'm going to do is I'm just going to show you exactly what we just did. So if I go to funnels here, I go to contacts right here, as you can see, we only have one contact, but I'm actually going to refresh this and look at that. We do have another email address, but it is tagged. Okay. So that way we know where our leads are coming from. Now, I actually want to show you one of my, you know, system.io accounts. And as you can see on this account, I do have 1,216 contacts. But the whole point here is to show you these tags. You know, Hustle's 3,000 ebook collection, 6,000 ebook collection, you know, so on and so forth. As you can see, I can go to 50. I mean, there's just a bunch of different you know, tags created, okay? You know. So now at this point of the video, you know how to use tags in system.io promoting affiliate products, but you're probably asking, hey Melvin, how can I sit here and grow my email list using a lead magnet? And that is why your next step should be to watch this video right here where I share with you just that. My name is Melvin. Thank you so much for stopping by and watching this video. If you found value in any way, consider liking and subscribing and hitting that notification bell. That way you don't miss out on any future videos. And best of all, Never stop the hustle. I'll see you in the next video.